around a year ago when I met the church. A week before that, I was just feeling really lost and hopeless and I had no idea what I was doing with my life. So I prayed for God or the universe or whatever was listening to me to give me a way. And a week later, I met the elders. And I guess the first time I had like a testimony of the church, of the gospel, was the first Sunday I went to the church. When I got there, I just felt so in peace, like I finally found the place that I belong. Since I've been baptized, my behavior has changed a lot. I've changed a lot. I'm a better person and my relationship with my mom and my brother has changed a lot, has improved a lot. And I've met people and I've made friends that I know that will be friends for life. And me and my friends, we actually like, we studied the Book of Mormon in English to improve our English. and. Just to get a closer relationship with each other and with God. Since I've been a member, my behavior has changed a lot. My standards are higher and I've just been a better friend, a better daughter, and a better person to be around. Jesus, he's my everything. He's my second chance is my way of seeing my dad again. The youth is the future. We are the future missionaries, the future leaders. So we have a big impact and we have a really big role. My plans and goals before I was a member and now haven't changed that much. I still don't know what I want to do with my life, but I do know that I want a f I wanted a family and now I want it even more because I know that it can be eternal. Being a member of a really small branch is really hard because we don't have a lot of active members and the youth, well there's three of us. So it's really hard, but we as board missionaries, we try to work with the elders introducing our friends. Like I, in the day of my baptism, I invited a friend, Inej, and she met the elders, she took the lessons, and she ended up being baptized herself. So our branch is growing because of that, and now she's a war missionary. So we've been helping each other and working with the missionaries. 2020 has been a crazy year. A lot has been happening, mainly the pandemic. and. At the same time, seeing everything that has been going on makes me sad of what's going on in the world. I'm also really happy because we're living in a time where prophecies are coming true. And that means that our Savior Jesus Christ is closer and closer to coming back to earth. So we need His teachings more than ever. We need the gospel more than ever.